Hello everyone, this video is going to be for the tree nerds out there, the plant geeks. This book is called Mora Culture. It's a very hard book to find. I had to do an inner library loan. Uh, you should look that up if you are into finding uh, hard to find books. Uh, they can send you books that aren't even available in your library. They might, ha might be coming from a different state. <clears throat> but anyway, I had to pay some money to even rent this book. Um, but it's all about mulberry. Um, that's the Morris genus is what mulberry is in and more culture is the cultivation of it. So, um, you know, I haven't read the whole book. It's very dense. It's got a lot of graphs and charts. Um, but there is a lot of useful information on how to grow mulberry. It's, it's a plant, it's a type of tree that's been cultivated for thousands of years, um, and has a rich history in Japan. Um, and they, they're doing some very interesting things, um, in the cultivation of it. Um, so for example, um, if we were to go to preparation, you know, there are some, some grafting diagrams, things I've never seen before in any, uh, tree book that I've read, um, talking about, you know, different types of grafting, uh, ways to work with cuttings, um, basically these really interesting tree hacks, I guess you could call them, um, ways to trellis them and train them. You may have to pause the video if you want to read any of this. Um, I'm also going to post in the description um, some some photos that I've taken um, and potentially the entire digital photocopy of the book if I can get that from the library. Sometimes they offer that in the interlibrary loan. Um, <clears throat> like I said, there's a lot of really dense technical stuff here, but then there are also some really interesting charts that um, or I'm sorry, some interesting diagrams that show ways to manage trees um, in a way that um, improves the way that they grow or makes them easier to harvest from. Uh, and, you know, so this is mainly done um, to provide leaves for the silkworm industry. But a lot of these concepts can be um, extrapolated to other types of trees out there. Um, for not just leaf production, but maybe other types of productions like fruit production or wood production. So really, really fascinating book. If you can get your hands on it and you're interested in this sort of thing, I'd say go for it. Um, but like I said, there's also a lot of uh, really dense material in here that may not be very useful to you. Um, but you'll definitely learn something and it's really outside of the box. So check it out uh, if uh, this sounds up your alley.